What up, y'all? Child Jesus Christ here again. Um, what does it mean to be saved by grace? What is a sinner saved by grace? Well, a sinner saved by grace is somebody who is unsaved. But later on, decided that they wanted to follow God. So what they had to do, Romans 10, 9, 4, if you confess with your mouth that Jesus Christ is Lord, believe it in your heart that God raised him from the dead, three days later you shall be saved. An unsaved person ha um, decided to follow God and receiving him, his son, as their personal Lord and Savior for salvation. When you truly believe in Jesus Christ's sacrifice for your sins, that he died on the cross to save you from hell, to save you from the penalty of your sins, then you are saved by grace. Ephesians chapter 3, 2 verse 8, chapter 2 verse 8 through 9, 3 verse 8, well, chapter, um, Chapter 2, verse 8 through 9. For it is by grace that you have been saved. By grace that you have been saved. Through faith. And not of ourselves. Through faith. You have to place your faith in Lord Jesus Christ. You have to receive him as your Lord and Savior. Through faith. Salvation comes through faith. And not of our works. Not being a good person. Being a good person is not going to get you saved from hell. Um, and not of ourselves. Not by works. And not of ourselves. Meaning we cannot get to heaven by ourselves. Only through the what Jesus Christ did for us on the cross. For it is the gift of God lest any man should boast. The gift of God is eternal life through his son Jesus Christ for all who believe in him. Lest any man should boast. Lest means so nobody can boast. Um, or unless a man could boast. So if it was of ourselves, we could boast. We could go around telling people... Um, we could go around bragging to people, Oh, I'm saved because I'm a good person. I'm better than you are. I deserve to go to heaven and you deserve to go to hell. You're not a good person, so you don't get to go to heaven. You're not as good as me, so you don't deserve to go to heaven. No, that's what it would be. If uh, That's what lest any man should boast means. Um, because we would be bragging about our salvation to people. That we could save, that we saved ourselves from hell. No, you can't save yourself from hell. You have to place your faith in Lord Jesus Christ, sacrifice, and receive Him as your Lord and Savior. When you receive Him as your personal Savior, you're taking yourself 2,000 something years back to the cross. And He's nailed up on the cross. And um, you're bowing down before Him. In faith and begging him to save you and he will he will only by receiving what Jesus Christ did for you when you receive him as Lord and Savior you're actually <clears throat> reconciled in a relationship with God reconciled means put back reconciled to bring back to be pulled back um, Meaning you can actually, you actually are worthy enough to stand before God, to be in a relationship with God. Um, he sees you as his son, because his son lives within you when you receive him as Lord and Savior, because his Holy Spirit does. Um, those who have the son have life, because those who have the son, which means have the son living in them. Have life, because Jesus Christ is life. 
Those who have the Son have life. But those who do not have the Son don't never received him as their Lord and Savior, will not see life, for the wrath of God abides on them. Him, him as in mankind. Um, but Jesus Christ took the wrath of his Father, God, on the cross when he died. So whoever shall believe in him, he already paid the penalty for their sins. Already did. The wrath of, you don't have to take the wrath of God if you accept the, the sacrifice of Lord Jesus Christ. That is what being saved by grace means. Hope you guys enjoy this video and talk to you later.